What is the Universal Periodic Review or the UPR? A unique mechanism of the United Nations Human Rights Council which involves a country-wise review of the human rights situation of 193 UN member states every five years. 42 states are reviewed each year. The results of review are made into an outcome report with recommendations and observations made to improve the human rights situation. The country is expected to adopt and implement changes before the next review cycle. What makes the UPR a unique process? Equality, participation and contribution by all citizens like you, creating a network between you, the government and national human rights institutions. Let's understand the UPR in four stages. The preparation. Three main documents used to conduct the review on human rights in the country. All reports are submitted to UN High Commissioner for Human Rights by the last date on the website. Presenting. Presenting a report on the status of human rights along with various measures taken to promote and protect your rights since the previous UPR. The country highlights the growth progress implemented in the past years. During India's review, 112 countries made 250 recommendations asking India to adopt a national plan on human rights, ratify the UN Convention Against Torture, increase public spending in the health sector, take futuristic steps to curb acts like honor killings and marital rape, Repeal Sections 377 to protect the rights of sexual minorities, human rights training of police officials, ensure access to adequate housing, water and sanitation. Adopting and acting on specific recommendations, the ones the country will be implementing during the next review period. On the 21st of September 2017, India presents the recommendations it is willing to accept in the next five years. The Implementation the implementation of the recommendations is evaluated through a voluntary mid-term review process in the HRC. Looking ahead, India's UPR for 2017 will end on 21st of September. India must now deliver and we, as responsible citizens and civil society actors, must play our part to ensure that the country keeps its word. Some ways you can help. Monitor recommendations made in UPR. Join the community in creating a situation for the government to realize the importance of the recommendations accepted and noted. Be an advocate for change. Need help? Look up the UN Substantial Development website, which looks like this. Provide credible and consistent information about the situation on the ground to international human rights bodies. We can and we must. We are the people. We are sovereign. We are the guardians of our constitution. Satyamev Jayate.